everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Terry. If you're new here, I really do appreciate you stopping by. In today's video, we're going to be doing an NGL anonymous Q&A. NGL is basically an app that you can post a link to your social media and anyone can click the link and ask you a question totally anonymously. So I'm gonna be answering anonymous questions that my followers sent in just as a way to get to know me better. And I told them to ask me anything. So it really could be anything. So let's see what people ask me. Okay, I have a weird theory that this app actually sends you things even though they're not from your followers because I received a submission before I even posted the link, which was very strange. I have done this Q&A before, like I've posted the link and just answered questions on my Instagram, which is at Terry Adriana with two A's at the end if you wanna follow me. I got the first one that was sent in was before I even posted it. So you wild for what you did is the first thing that someone said. So I don't know, this app might be a little bit interesting. And the next one was you a homie. So totally not questions, but thank you so much. The third one was shout me out. Well, I have no idea who you are. So hi, here's your shout out, anonymous person. The first actual question is, did you have an imaginary friend? I did. I had two when I was younger. They were like twins that were like miniature, at least I think. I don't know, it's hard to remember. I think their names, I know one of them was named George. I wanna say the other one, I have no idea what the name was, but I think it was like a girl and a boy, twins, and those are my imaginary friends that were tiny so I could take them wherever I went. <laughs> is that silly or like relatable? I don't know, let me know. <laughs> the next question is, are you busy this weekend? I'm just gonna let you know my plans, I guess. Uh, tonight is a Friday. So tonight I'm meeting up with two friends who I went to school with. I haven't seen Aiden in like a few years. So it's gonna be nice to catch up, get some food and yeah, see them. And then tomorrow I'm probably editing this video so I can get it up probably for Sunday. <laughs> and then on Sunday night, I'm actually going roller skating slash rollerblading at this fun place for a friend's birthday. So those are my plans for the weekend. Not too crazy, but some fun things happening. The next question is what color is your room? So my room is like a white color. I actually film in my parents' bedroom because it has the best light and like a nice background. So this is actually my parents' room. My room is basically like a like a very slightly warm white color. It's called Ibis. It's from Sheridan Williams. Is that the name? Sherwin Williams. It's from Sherwin Williams. I really like the color. I've wanted like white walls in my room for quite a while. They used to be like a really light pink color, but they didn't really match the like purple theme I had going. The next question is single and I'm not single. I am married to my husband, Anthony. We are actually planning a wedding even though we're already married. I have a whole wedding series about that um, that I've started posting episodes for. If you wanna watch along that process, definitely subscribe. But yes, I am not single. All right, the next question is a really good one, I think. What was one of the best things about your Disney program? If you're unaware, I worked at Disney in the summer of 2017 and the summer of 2019 in Disney's International College program. I'm from Canada, so they did sponsor me for a couple months within the summer and I worked in Disney World. So I worked in Haunted Mansion the first year and then Cosmic Rays, which is a food and beverage place in Tomorrowland, which is in Magic Kingdom. So the the best part about my Disney program was probably the fact that you're working and meeting people from around the world because they hire people from around the world. And so you make amazing friends with all sorts of people and you get to go to the parks with them whenever you want <laughs> because you have a uh, free admission. So those are definitely the two best things, definitely the friendships I made and the park access was pretty sick. <laughs> All right, the next question is, why doesn't my crush like me back? Oh, I'm sorry. I, I don't know. Um, I would say the best advice I could give would be, I don't know, are you letting them know that you're into them? Are you pretending not to like them? Maybe they do like you and you just think they don't like you. I don't know, but I hope that works out. <laughs> Okay, the next question is, are you judgmental? I really hope I'm not. I don't think I am. I try not to be, at least. I mean, I don't think anyone tries to be judgmental. At least, I hope not. Um, I don't think I'm very judgmental. Hopefully the person that sent this in doesn't think I'm actually judgmental. Anyways, <laughs> so that's the answer to that. 
I'm not. The last question is how tall are you? So the answer is 5'7", so pretty tall. I think I was predicted to be 5'8", when I was a baby, like by the time I was full grown, they thought I'd be 5'8", but I'm like 5'7", and like a little bit, like a tiny bit, so that's all. <laughs> so those are all the questions that came in when I posted the link. If you want to do a Q&A like this for yourself and see what anonymous questions come in, I'll post the link to the app down below. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a like and comment down below. Any question you have for me, of course it won't be anonymous, but I'll do my best to answer. And please don't forget to subscribe if you have not already. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.